Hey friends, it's Tom from Telluride Music. I'm back here in the vault this morning and just wanted to show you a little bit more about using the black light on vintage finishes. We're gonna look at two common finish repairs on this 1916 Gibson F4 mandolin. Let's switch off the lights and here we go. So as you can see immediately, the instrument fluoresces, which means that there's a lot of old original finish here, but there are two areas that really jump out to me. The first one is up here. This was actually a repair. Um, there's a crack and this is more than likely a drop fill. What I mean by drop fill is that a luthier will use glue to pull finish into the crack and drop fill is, is typically going to look really dark like this, just because it's a material that's really different from the lacquer itself. The next area is right here, where it's just a really light, faint disruption. It doesn't fluoresce in the same way. Um, if it's wear, like here and here, then it's just the wear of the finish. But in this spot, as you saw before, it looked like it was glossy and like the finish was pristine there. So this is more than likely overspray, and in fact, when you really examine it with your naked eye, you can see that there's some glossier finish there. But under the black light, it shows up immediately. And as I pull this closer, you can see it looks just really dark. So again, overspray, and right there, some real clear drop fill as well as up here. Thanks for watching. More on this soon.